Hey, what's going on, CoinUp TV subscribers? Robert Welkner here. We're going to do an unboxing for Starlink Battle for Atlas. This is the Lance spaceship, and it comes with Hunter Hakar, if I'm saying that right, and his weapon, the Imploder, right here. So you can kind of see most of the ship just in the uh, bubble wrap, the uh, packaging by itself. But uh, let's crack it open in a second to check things out. Let's look at the back real quick. We got Hunter's um, bio, or at least his uh, skill information. Honorable warrior pierces multiple targets with his ship. So if you didn't know, the characters have their own abilities in the game. The ships have their own abilities in the game. And of course the weapons have their own abilities too. And they can kind of interchange with each of the different ships there. The Lance says intercept fast foes with a performance class ship. So when you're in the game and you're looking at the stats, it'll actually show which ships are the fastest, which ones are have the most um, durability and stuff like that. So it's just kind of a matter of uh, when you get into different situations, how you want to go about uh, tackling down some of the, the villains, the bad guys, the aliens on the planets that you're gonna face. Also, these ships can work with the uh, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Nintendo Switch, so ships, figures, pieces, weapons are, are all interchangeable. Here is a look at Hunter, somewhat up close. Uh, he's got kind of cool pose, kind of uh, like a ready to attack or defend pose there. Nice paint job, good facial expression, nice little figure. So these mount onto the the uh, accessory there that goes onto your controller and then the ships go on top of them. I have an unboxing demonstration, unboxing video of the playset starter kit demonstrating all that. Uh, now from the get-go, I've always thought this was one of the cooler looking ships. And uh, now that I have it in my hand, it definitely looks pretty cool. It's got like a sleek, pointy, dynamic design to it. Uh, props to whoever designed this ship. I like the little gold trim here, the black, red, and gold. Uh, this is crazy pointy, so <laughs> be careful not to let that drop and fall down on your foot. And we got a little clear space here. So it says over here, E19 SB4. Nice. These are these are some pretty durable plastic material. There's a little, little flex to them, but not a whole lot. They feel very durable. I was wondering if you can kind of stand the ship up. So my only problem, my only complaint with these ships is they don't come with like a stand. So if you put that there, that'll stand flat. It'd be nice if you can kind of stand it up there, but it doesn't look like that's possible. And finally, here's the imploder, which this looks kind of cool. We got like a little purple gem in there. So uh, it comes with one of the weapons you can snap on here. And then the starter kit comes with uh, weapons as well, so you can snap on another one there, or you can just wiggle, get that off there. And the pilot is in the ship. You see, can we see a little bit of him? <laughs> he is he is difficult to see through the cockpit window there, but you can see there's a little bit of space. So, all right, not bad. Cool looking ship. Once it gets open, uh, we'll have to see how this plays out in the game. Again, this is the Lance ship. And it comes with the imploder weapon and hunter figure. Let me know in the comments below what you think of the ship. If you're going to be picking this up for Coin Out TV, thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.